Hi everybody. I am walking in the forest. Hopefully you can hear some amazing sounds and I want to talk a little bit about sacred partnership and how it's different from regular normal relationships. Sacred partnership is the divine union, the spiritual union of the divine feminine energy and the divine masculine energy in human bodies, in an actual human marriage. And generally, it happens with a man who's in his masculine energy and a woman who's in her feminine energy. Although it can happen any which way, it can happen with a woman who's in her masculine energy and a man who's in his feminine. It can happen with other combinations of energies. I particularly focus on helping women, feminine women in their 30s and 40s who like to be married and would like to have children, create sacred partnership with a masculine man who leads and who's got your back. So you can be that divine feminine. And there's a lot of misconceptions in the world about relationships. A lot of drama, a lot of false truths, a lot of disturbing narratives, a lot of messages and concepts that are not a reflection of the natural order. They're not a reflection of divine order and so my goal with this channel is to bring us back to divine order and why do I think I can do this because I dated for 10 years before I married my husband and we are now in a sacred partnership but <laughs> there was a lot to learn uh, however Mostly, I should say, there was a lot to unlearn because there were so many false messages and false concepts. So I want to start off today's video by talking about three ways that sacred partnership is different than same old, same old. The first thing that we often hear in relationships is that you have to compromise. Well, I'm here to tell you that no. In sacred partnership, we don't compromise. Power couples understand this. Successful business people who negotiate win-win deals understand this. They understand the importance and the value of each person having their full needs met, their full desires met. And so in a sacred partnership, the questions the partners ask isn't, how can we compromise here? How can we, you give a little, I'll give a little, we'll find a way through. No. The question sacred partnershipers, <laughs> sacred partnershipers ask. I'm going to wait for that plane to pass. The question sacred partnershipers ask is, what can we co-create? What can we synergize on? What can we alchemize on? Where it's not a compromise, but it's a synergy. And just a reminder that a synergy is not a symbiosis. A synergy is one plus one is more than two. And I want to tell you that this is a really big difference between normal human relationships and sacred partnership is that in sacred partnership we do not do compromise both people know that there's there's not such a thing as compromise and or it's very rare now the reason why it does happen is because we live in a physical world and sometimes there are transactional aspects to our relationships that do require us to choose one thing over another and you could consider that a compromise. <sighs> Miracles flow when we synergize. 
And synergy can only come from our human spirit self. It can come from our, the part of us that's confident in abundance and that's living in choice. And it cannot come from our human animal side, which is the part of us that's living in survival that we all have. And we're not trying to get rid of our animal side. We are just honoring our animal side, learning to partner with her, and learning to love her. Because she is indeed amazing. Now, another difference between sacred partnership and regular relationships, other than there's no compromise, is that there is no sacrifice. There is no sacrifice. It comes down to the same thing like I talked about before. No powerful, abundant, generous person who is living in their human spirit wants another powerful, generous person to sacrifice for them. If you are in a power partnership, you figure out a way through this by co-creating, not by compromising or sacrificing. So there is no sacrifice in sacred partnership. Instead, there's synergy in co-creation. And the other thing, the other way that, the other third way that sacred partnership is different than regular relationships is that there is no drama. Ha ha, that is true. But uh, what I was going to say is that there's no sacrifice, there's no compromise, and there's also no settling. So we're not settling for somebody that we're not like head over heels in love with or don't want to wake up next to every morning. Because you know what? Life is too short for that. And we don't live in that kind of world anymore where our survival depends on being partnered up and being married, especially as women, right? So if we're going to be in a partnership, it better be good. There's no point in doing anything less, right? So these are the three paradigm shifts of sacred partnership. There is no compromise. Instead, there's co-creation. There's no sacrifice. Instead, there's synergy. And there's no settling. And instead, there is alchemy. So this is what the channel is going to be about. Also, sacred partnership is 5D love. And it is the way forward for our relationships, our families, our societies, and our culture and our world. So who knew that when I became a relationship coach, I would be doing spiritual and social activism. But here I am. And I invite you to join me on this journey. I'll be sharing regularly on this channel all things dating, all things mating, all things selecting a mate for long-term fulfilling love. I will say that this channel is going to be geared for feminine single women who want as much success in their love life as they've had in their career. They've been able to co-create a lot of wealth and abundance in their lives in terms of health and wealth and their life is full and beautiful and in that way. And yet you're still struggling in relationships with men because either you're attracting the wrong men and or you don't yet have the skills for sacred union but that's why I'm here and that's why I started this channel and I want to say this is a truther channel and I am going to be telling the truth about our social constructs our current paradigms what isn't working I'm not going to be going along with the mainstream narrative of the you know what (sighs) 
we're going to a whole new place, you guys. We're going to sacred partnership on planet Earth. And sacred partnership requires us to be in our unique, authentic power. We can't do sacred partnership disempowered. We can't do sacred partnership giving away our power. We can't do sacred partnership like, like, and for that reason, we can't do sacred partnership compromising or settling or sacrificing. Because when we compromise, settle, and sacrifice, we're not in our power. I know it sounds crazy, but this is 5D Earth Love. And I'm here to guide you in that direction. So, welcome to my channel. And I look forward to talking with you more. Bye.